And in real estate a bit, I bet you people have sent you homes they want to see from Zillow. That's on you. It's not because Zillow's better. It's because you're not providing them a hyper-local real estate experience. What's that mean? Local info relevant to them. No one cares what the average home sale price is, but realtors, they care about where they live, where they want to live. So I'm going to show you how to do that really quickly. All right, let's go into our friend, KW Command. So whether you use Command for your home business or just to have Melissa cut you a check, it's a really great part of Command. And there's a bunch of you that already get this email from me every two weeks right before our stakeholder meeting. You are going to go to Smart Plans. So ultimately, when we prospect, we need to learn about our people, right? And if you don't know someone's address, you're probably never going to sell their house. So there would be a good thing to focus on getting from more people, right? The more addresses you get, the more hyper-local real estate info you can provide to people. So you see my smart plans loaded here. Yours might be empty because these are mine. You need to add them from the library. So I click library. And this is all you have to do, I promise. Scroll down here. It's a featured. Ta-da. There it is. Bi-weekly neighborhood nurture. That is an email every two weeks. There is a monthly neighborhood nurture. Don't use that one. Because everybody doesn't open every email. Do the bi-weekly and see the steps. What are they? Send an email, wait two weeks, send it again. So all you got to do is click add smart plan. I'd click it, but then an error will pop up and says, you have it already. Because I do, right? So all you got to do then is work this really simply. You can do this two ways. I'm going to show you the prospecting way. The other way is a thing called the bulk action where you can filter for who has a neighborhood, which is any address you have. Because when you add an address to a contact and command, it populates that neighborhood. So here is some really weak Craigslist lead I got 900 years ago. And you can see I don't have the address. If I populate the address, you know what pops in? His address, his neighborhood, right? That's cool. So I'll spare you that part, but put in your client's addresses, your contact addresses, learn where they live. You also want to learn where they want to live. Somebody wants to say, learn about Lowry, where I live, put it in. And now they get their own email with this useful portal that is only about the real estate they care about. So you don't have to send them seven emails about seven neighborhoods, send them one email about the seven neighborhoods they care about, right? See? Some cool info on here, handsome guy right there, a nice map. If anybody in here, my son just got confused when I called myself handsome. All right, see, simple. All you gotta do, add to smart plan. Pick the smart plan. And this contact every two weeks will get a touch from you. That's 26 a year, only about the real estate they care about. They don't care about the average home price in Brighton. I don't care about the average home price in Brighton, and I'm a real estate agent, right? So you just scroll down, you're going to have a lot less smart plans than me. Click select, and it adds it. That will start to execute the biweekly neighborhood nurture, providing that hyper-local real estate information I just talked about to your database so they stop sending you homes from Zillow. Thanks for watching Tech Tuesday. See you next Tuesday. Bye.